Welcome back to the channel, everybody. I'm Lady Nika, and with some celebrity news and entertainment, child. Uh, I was over on the Daily Mail, and I'm going to link that down in the description box. You know, the article to which um, I got my tea from, I'm going to link it. But I wanted to come in and talk about this article that I found over on the Daily Mail concerning our girl, Wendy Williams, right? Um, I will link this article down in the pinned comments for you to go and look at it for yourselves later. But in the meantime, in between time, let's talk a little bit about the article. In the weeks since filing for her divorce from husband Kevin Hunter, it has been reported that talk show host Wendy Williams has been seeking an appropriate platform to air a tell-all about her experience, but CBS this morning was reportedly not one to welcome her with open arms. According to the Daily Mail, Williams was interested in giving an interview to the morning show host, but Gail King did not approve. The reasoning was that King believed the topics, including the affair of Hunter's husband and arrest of her son for assault, may be too trashy for the morning television uh, show as supposedly linked by network sources. Williams also, uh, Williams is also said to be looking at other outlets that may be a, be a right fit for sharing her story, including Oprah's own networks, ABC and NBC. One source tells the Daily Mail.com that her people want either a morning show or an hour-long primetime special. They want Wendy to sit down with a big-name anchor like Gail King at the top of the list. Williams was also making other big changes in the midst of her divorce. Her soon-to-be ex-husband was also her manager, a position that now needs to be filled. As reported by BET in April, Wendy Williams' uh, show host is said to have recruited producer Bernie Young as she reclaims ownership over her life. Williams will, however, remain executive producer of her show until further notice. Whichever platform ultimately secures the interview will be a big win for ratings as Williams has a legion of devoted Wendy watchers that has that she has amassed over a decade-long career in television. This appears to be a wait-and-see situation, but it seems as though King and Williams are at a standstill until further notice. I told you, you guys, that she was trying to secure a spot over at... Um, you know, CBS or one of the bigger networks to do this one hour sit uh, tell all. And although I support Wendy, I'm starting to like her. She's starting to get her likability status back with me. However, I still feel as if Wendy is not telling us anything that me, uh, thousands of other women haven't already gone through. She had a husband. He cheated. As a result of his cheating, she finally got tired and decided to end things. Uh, as the divorce is in the process, um, she was still trying to somewhat maintain uh, uh, a bond with uh, Kevin Sr. on the strength of Kevin Jr. And for reasons unknown, uh, altercation broke out. It's alleged that it's because he wanted his dad to stop depending on his mama money. And, you know, Kevin had, I did an article where I told you guys that he was trying to ask for spousal support as well as uh, child support. Although this story is interesting, it's not worth a whole hour on a primetime network. And that's just my honest opinion. If she want to do all that, then put it in a book like most people do. But to actually sit down with a major network, with a major network anchor, and air out your dirty laundry, I'm not really all that interested in seeing that. So I can totally understand why a girl wouldn't want to do that interview. Now, if she want to do that, here's my suggestion. And it's the same suggestion that I gave um in my last reporting of this tell about it on your own show if you feel that that is so much of a big story that you want to actually do the show you want to do the someone to do an interview with you bring somebody on your show and allow them somebody that's reputable in the business and allow them to interview you if you want to get your uh, story out there more your side of it but to actually for 
I can't see a primetime network like on ABC, NBC, or CBS wanting to do that. Wendy is doing the most right about now in the book of my mind, and I'm just, I'm not all that interested. Now, I, I find strength in her story because it's one that is shared by many women out here, but to actually take up a one-hour primetime slot for her story is just not to me it's not newsworthy enough for that uh i know gail did r kelly but she did r kelly right after r kelly was there was this huge miniseries that came out in january and he had just been accused uh indicted on 11 counts of sexual abuse and assault wendy's story is a little bit different this is a although heartbreaking not uncommon story for a lot of women out here so I, I don't I'm not surprised that Gail wasn't interested in it. I'm not upset that she wasn't interested in it. My suggestion again is if she really wants to do this, do it on your own show. Take that to your own show. You have a big audience. If you feel that your story is so important that it needs to uh be discussed in a whole one hour interview then bring it to the Wendy show and allow a guest host to come in and interview you because I don't see any major network taking this on now I could be wrong but I just don't see what this is just that big of a story to take up such an important time slot for major networks and I don't see them going along with that sad story but not uncommon that's it. That's all, y'all. I'll link it down in the description by, I mean, in the pinned comments so that you can go over and read the entire article for yourself. And remember, the depth of your struggle will determine the height of your success. In the meantime, in between time, please remember to rate the video. Ratings get me recognized on these YT streets. Comment down in the panic, a.k.a. comments. Let me know what you think about this. Do you agree or do you think that Wendy deserves a prime time slot on a major network to basically do a tell-all interview? Or do you think that she should do it on her show or better yet do what a lot of other people have done? Write your old nasty tell-all book. Let me know. If you have not become a love thing today for the free 99, please hit your subscribe button. Also tap the notification bell button so that each and every time I go live from this channel or upload a video, you will be notified and you can come over and join in the conversation. I will see you guys back tonight for the have and have nots. Have a great remainder to your Tuesday. Peace.